Hey guys, this is Matt for Creative. Today we're taking a look at a product I got from Five Below. This is the Vibe. Now this is a cool little device because this will hold your phone so you can make videos like I'm making. Right now I'm using a Canon camera, but I can use my iPhone 12 mini. I can use the other one that I have. Um, and this supposedly is just all everything in a compact little package. And this goes for five bucks. Video creation is extremely popular right now, so this is probably really all you need to make a video. Literally all you need is just some good light. I have like two mini light boxes on me right now, but you could just like point yourself in the direction of a lamp. Have a lamp light you up and you're perfectly fine. That's all you need. But something like this for five bucks, just to get it maybe at this level here, this is perfect. So for, yeah, five bucks, Definitely had to got, got this, get this, and give it a try. So yeah, literally this is it. And this is pretty tiny. Oh, it has a suction cup. So there may be an issue here because this is a wood, like cutting board material table. And I'm curious to see, will this actually work? All right, now do I have to loosen anything? Apparently not. It kind of clicks into place. And I'm going to take this off and hope that this will kind of... Wait, can you even see? Take a look at this. So this is the stand... Oh, wait. Take a look at the stand. So this is the stand. Okay, it does stick. It's pretty, it's pretty on there. You lock, okay, that works out. You can see the material here. It's not completely smooth, but this works out. All right, now let me move this because I'm like, all right, no, this is fine actually. All right, so you have one way to orientate, orient your phone like this. This clips, oh wait, I turned the flashlight on. So this would clip here. Shoot, it's a little bit wobbly. It's a little bit kind of just, it's not exactly, holding it correctly here. But the reason is, I'm trying not to have this land right on the power button. Because, let's see, would this actually turn this off? It's not, it's not, it's holding it, but not enough to actually press the button, which is good. But I'm assuming if I took the case off, I maybe have a different. So the only way you can get this kind of perfectly balanced is if you can just balance it, center of the phone, just think, if you have like a different power button configuration on your phone, just just be mindful of that. So right now I'm going to release this. Wow, this is this is a <laughs> this is a good suction cup. It's a really good suction cup because what I'm going to do. All right, it's a good suction cup. All right, we're going to go as tall as possible and does this give us the height that we need. I'm gonna flip this back over to me. And it's pretty much, it's pretty much here. So I can always lower my chair height here if I really wanted to, just to get it kind of here. But hey, this works out perfectly. This is a pretty good height. Can this go, wait, oh, no way, can this, Look at that. Now it may be, a, like this is perfect. It may be a little bit shaky, honestly, but this is eye level. This is exactly where you want this to be. Can this also extend too? So let's see here. Yeah, you can, wow, this is actually pretty good. So you can orientate the phone two different ways. Let's get this out of the way. Yeah. So if you're doing portrait style for TikTok or for anything, does this work out fine? Yeah, this works out really fine. Okay, five bucks, five dollars. Really, that's all it is. Is this made of, it's made of metal. It's probably aluminum, but it is made of metal. And this thing, is super sticky. Holy, wow. 
Oh, it's adhesive. This is adhesive. It's not a suction cup. This is made... Oh, I actually don't like that. I should have felt it first, but this is actually adhesive. So there's a chance... No wonder it stuck so well on here. Now, is this one of those adhesives that you can kind of clean and come back to? Oh, shoot. I'm gonna have to keep this like little thing here. All right, this is kind of a good thing to kind of maybe read before opening this. So features, adjustable cradle, foldable limbs, sturdy suction base. It does not mention the uh, sticky base at all. Lightweight and portable, foldable phone stand. It again says suction base, but you can see here, here, that is not really a suction base. That is a sticky residue material. Hear that? Okay. Just gotta, gotta be mindful of that. Did I lose the plastic? No, nope. it's just so, wow. All right, so I'm just gonna make sure that this is stuck here so that adhesive doesn't go away. Um, if you guys have any questions about this later on, hey, did the adhesive kind of work out? Um, how do I fold this back? Fold this way here. Yeah, did the adhesive work out? Wait, can I go like this? That's it. Um, yeah, any questions about use of this? So for me, I'm gonna always try and shoot with you know, the best that I have. I have been shooting a lot more with <coughs> with the iPhone just because, I don't know, I've stopped bringing this camera with me with either this big professional lens or the smaller lens. I've really been shooting with just the iPhone and that's it, just because it does shoot in uh, Apple's Pro Raw and it, wait, is that the, oh, and then also you can film in Pro Res, which, I don't know. Uh, the filming kind of out and about, that looks fine. It's great to have something like this that's really portable. You can just put this in your backpack and then you are all set because it's literally just the height that you want to reach. Um, and it does, it can suction and stick to a lot of materials. Again, I'm curious to see how this material will, will work. Like maybe one day it'll just kind of lose its stickiness and then we're kind of like in a bad place because like, with this, it did not work. Wait. Actually, I just want to make sure I didn't hurt the table. Because I don't want anything to stick too long. The thing is, if <coughs> if I had an iPhone in here, sorry, I think I just choked on something like air. If I had an iPhone in this, um, if I had the weight on there, and if I had this for like an hour, would that be as easy uh, to remove without getting something on the table? I'm a little bit worried about that. But just think about that, and it's good. This is why we do these reviews. So again, got this from Five Below. This one was five bucks. I think this is great. This does exactly what you need it to, so I'm happy with it. Yeah, I don't think you could ask for much more. I would like them to say that this does have sticky adhesive, and uh, maybe that would help. Can you see that? That's the thumbnail. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget, put everything in the comment section below. I'm on Instagram. <clears throat> I'm on Instagram at m8b9. You can email me at matt8b9 at gmail.com. What else? That's it. We're going to be opening a lot of stuff from Five Below just because I went on a shopping spree and a lot of the stuff is interesting. And it's good for, like, little holiday gifts. It's good to get yourself if you want to be a video creator. Again, you don't need this just to make videos. The same thing would be, it would be a same video if I had like an iPhone 6 and I just use the stand. As long as you have good light and this is pointed at you at the right height, then you can make a professional and usable video. And that's it. All right guys, thank you again and I will see you next time.